Hello everybody, I hope you're all having a fantastic day and welcome to Bishop Aquatics. Today we're going to be looking at the most common ways to identify a male from a female guppy. You can do this very early on with juveniles um, on some of these ways and other ones you do need to wait till they're a little bit more mature. So, uh, with most of these it will apply to you know any guppy breed or strain and with some of these it is a little more specific um, for example some breeds the males have completely different coloration and pattern than the females so it's very easy once they get their color in to tell what fish is what others the fish look the exact same whether male or female uh, especially guppies so uh, it's a little harder on those uh, those would be the harder ones, you have to use another method. So that brings us right into our first way to identify a male from a female guppy. So what we're looking at right now is the Vienna guppy. Uh, this one is an easier one because the females do not have a fraction of a color the males do. And this can be a little deceiving with this particular strain because there are some males that don't have much color and they should not be confused with the female. So, here we have adult ones. The female is generally with guppies is going to be larger, less colorful, and have a gravid spot if they're of mature age. What is a gravid spot, you might ask? You see that little spot right before her uh, anal fin? It's that dark spot kind of towards the back of her belly. That's a gravid spot. That's how you know she's a female. Very easy. And some of these are very minor details and I'm gonna have to take pictures and I'll talk about the picture because we just won't be able to see it on film. So that is the easiest and first way to tell if you got a female. Depending on your strain, she'll have less color than the male and be larger. So I guess those could be two different things. Count that as one and two, put them together. And the third way is by a gravid spot. Gravid spot is a dark spot near the back of the belly or before the anal fin. Alright, now let's go back to our juveniles over here. So they're going to be harder to identify and this is what most people are going to be trying to do this for. Is identifying these harder to identify younger fish. And the way you do that is by looking at the fins. Male and female guppies have different fins the ventral or pelvic fin to be specific. That's the one right below the pectoral fin, before the anal fin. It's at the front half of the guppy, right kind of below their chin, if guppies had chins. And I'll, I'll try to pull up a picture of this because you're not going to see it on film very well at all. Basically, the females have a more smooth, rounded, crescent moon shape and the males have a pointy, skinnier fin. And that's how you know if it's a male or a female. And you can tell this from a very young age. It is uh, probably one of the best techniques if you don't see any obvious identifiers of sex to find out what gender your fish is. And like I was saying, I know this isn't gonna come up on film, so we will pull up a picture and look at it in that picture. And that is the easiest way to tell the differences in gender of guppies. Thanks for tuning in guys. I hope you all have a fantastic day and I'll see you next time.